There's growing backlash tonight against a controversial change at Time Warner. It will change how you pay for internet service. Instead of paying a monthly fee for unlimited service, you'll have the option of two different plans, which will allow you a certain amount of internet downloads. Plans are expected to range from $29.99 a month to $54.90 a month. And if you go over your monthly download quota, you could pay more. The new billing will start in June. Well, do you really ever think about how much you use the internet? You might want to start. As News 8's Elizabeth Harness reports, some downloads are cheap, while others may cost you. Chances are you've never even considered how much you download on the internet. You should. Under Time Warner's new plan, you get 5 to 40 gigabytes per month before being charged. That's depending on your plan. I don't think most people would, would know where to classify themselves. Uh, you know, people are used to having the connection on available and they just use it however they choose. We took a look at some of the most common downloads with RIT's Director of Information Technology, Dan Tobin. Most don't take much. Facebook, an average application, is about 350 kilobytes. It would take dozens of downloads to get just one gig. Then there's music. An album download at the highest quality is about 83 megabytes. Download about 12 albums and you've hit one gig. But photos, that's a different story. You can take up a little bit of bandwidth or a lot. It depends on what you're doing. You decide to put those up, um, you know, to a, to a web page, to uh, you know, to Flickr, to Picasa Web, wherever. You don't really know how much you're taking because those tend to get sized down. Among all the things that we've measured out, the one thing that people seem to be using the most these days on their computer is YouTube. But there was no way to really measure exactly how much each download on YouTube actually takes up. You have kids at home, you have multiple computer, computers like you, you know we do at my house, um, it's really hard to fathom how much uh, bandwidth without really measuring it and taking a look that, uh, that we are potentially using. The biggest bandwidth vacuum, movies. A high quality average two hour movie is eight gigs, which can max out your allowance from Time Warner depending on your plan. So an eight, eight gig movie after you've hit your cap would you know cost you about $8. Uh, to download above and beyond whatever charges you'd have to download that movie from the service uh, that you're using in the first place. Elizabeth Harness, News 8. We spoke with representatives from Time Warner. They tell us based on a survey, the average customer used five gigs per month.